Hi everyone, I'm Eric with Bridgecom Tech Department, and I'm going to walk you through the steps to image your SkyBridge SD card. So let's go open a web browser and search for a couple files we need to download. First is going to be the PyStar uh, image. That is essentially the OS that we run. So we Google that, go to that first link that we saw, and scroll down on the page on this left-hand sidebar, go over Downloads, and you'll see a Download PyStar image. Click on that, and that will open up this page. Now here at the top, you'll see Available Images to Download. Uh, we want to download the PyStar Raspberry Pi image, uh, whichever one is the latest date. So for us, uh, it's going to be this bottom one on the list that's version 4.1.5, um, released out in October of last year, 2021. So we are going to download that. And then we need to head back to Google and we need to get an imaging software. So you can use whichever imaging software you like. There's a couple of them out there, but uh, my favorite for this task is going to be, um, we're just gonna use the Raspberry Pi imager. So let's look for that. Click on that first link that you see and um, it'll take you to this page. Um, this will be. This is the same imager that's used for uh, flashing the Raspberry Pi SD cards with the Raspberry Pi OS, um, which works perfect because the SkyBridge uses a Raspberry Pi as the base computer. So let's go download for Windows. If you have a Mac, um, these steps will be different. So keep that in mind. So now that we have both those files downloaded, as you can see, let's install our imager. Click on that. And then just hit yes. And we're going to leave this box run Raspberry Pi imager checked because we're going to use it in just a moment. So that's going to launch that application. And we're going to go back here to our downloads and open that downloaded uh, Raspberry Pi um, or the PyStar image, I should say. And I'm just going to open that with File Explorer. You'll notice there's two files in here. Um, click on that top one that says type disk image file. That's going to be the one we need. We're going to copy that to the desktop. Give that just a moment here. Okay, you can see our file is here on the uh, desktop. Uh, next up, we need to plug our SD card into our machine. I'm going to do that now. Now we need to go to our Raspberry Pi imager. Um, if you did not open this, just go to the start menu and type in imager. It should come up. We're going to choose the OS. Scroll down on here till you get uh, use custom the very last option. Click on that. We're going to go ahead and um, click on your username over here on the side. Click on desktop. And uh, there's our image file. So we can click open. Next we need to choose a storage device. So click on that. You can see our SD card is in the machine. Lastly, we just need to click right. It's going to warn us that everything on this SD card is going to be erased. So don't use one that you use in your camera. It's going to take a moment. And there we go. That's going to just write away for us. So we will touch base as soon as it's finished writing. Once it finishes writing, it will go through a verification just to make sure everything's been written successfully. So we'll let that finish. Uh, 
And there you have it. Uh, your SD card has been successfully imaged with Pystar. Go ahead and take that SD card out of your computer and put it in your SkyBridge and boot it up.